Good evening to those who will listen. It is June 27, 2018, 8.48 p.m. And it's been an hour and 45 minutes since we contacted them. And I just uh, got a text from my friend who went to the next town up two miles up. And he said that it's going to be another 90 minutes. That was about 10 minutes ago. So we're talking a three-hour wait just to get them here. And then they said... Uh, that they'll have a guy to fix the tire and then they got to send a second guy a separate guy to fix the to fix the taillight assembly they told me they said if uh, I'm about 130 miles away from where I was trying to get to Davenport Iowa and they said if they can't uh, the guy can't come out then they will tow us all the way back to Davenport which seems funny because that's like two hours two and a half hours away 130 miles about not exactly sure, but it's between 130 and 140 miles. And as long as we're here, I'll show you the sun simulator. And the moon just came out over in the east. And the sun's already down over the horizon. But I can show you some colors and some chemtrails. This is really sad. And, you know, I have an appointment tomorrow for my Section 8. And if I don't make that appointment tomorrow... Then Friday they're closed, obviously Saturday and Sunday they're closed, and Monday I don't even know if they're open, but it'll already be July 1st, and I might miss my window to get into my new Section 8 apartment. And if that happens, I might have to wait an entire month before I can get into my apartment. It'll be August 1st, and I don't want to wait that long. I mean, I got somewhere to stay with my sister, but, you know, I, I really want to get my own place. And then, you know, another thing too... Uh, my, I, my kids can't come over and see me unless I have my own place. You know, they can, I mean, uh, it's a long story, but they can't come over to my sister's house. Uh, it's not because of my sisters, because of my mom. But that's you know, another story, and I'm not going to worry about that right now. So I don't want to make this really long because I want to save more in case I need to record some more stuff that's happening. But there's a sunset over there. I mean, it's already over the horizon. A few chemtrail came clouds not so much trails anymore there was trails earlier and there was a lot of haze now uh, here's oh look at that that's kind of funky looking I don't look normal either all right now check this out the moon is just coming up over the horizon over in the east kind of looks orange don't it Wow and it's got is that energy around it again well People were gonna. People were saying, "Well, when you leave Colorado, you might not get like the same images. You might get something different because you're in a totally different area." Uh, I don't know what the elevation is right here in in uh, Davenport. It's between 700 and uh, and I think a thousand feet. So I'm guessing it's probably about the same here, a thousand maybe. So it can't be too much, but it does look like the energy again. You look at that thing. Now it looks totally different than what I ever got. In Colorado, it looks like there's a square in the middle of it. I'm trying to bide the time away. So I told you, yeah, it's, uh, it's uh, already been an hour and 45 minutes, waiting another hour and a half. That's just to get them here. I hope they come a little bit sooner because when it gets dark, I'm in this big field of tall grass where I know there's going to be tons of mosquitoes coming out and then I'll have to sit in the in the U-Haul truck which I don't want to do because it's really super hot and if I turn on the truck the battery will wear down and the gas will go down and I don't have much gas in this thing either and I don't want to wear the battery out either so I have the hazards on that's already sucking up some of the, the battery and we're not in the, the most safe place either. We're off the road. I'm on the shoulder and half on the... Not even half on the on the grass in here. And if you look down here, we can't pull it over anymore. I don't know if you can see this because... I don't know if it looks flat to you, but it's like an angle. And the whole truck would probably just tip over. And everything would be really bad. <laughs> please, please pray for us. You know... By the time you see this video, everything will be over with, and look, I will be. Jeez, 
we'll be at our destination, but still pray for us because there's a lot, a lot more to do. I'm going to ask for a full refund on this because we've had nothing but problems. We've had one tail light was was broken and gone. Before we left, I told them they fixed it. Then yesterday, it totally got destroyed again, and the whole tail light was gone. They fixed it yesterday. We had to wait two hours for that, and now this happens, and we're waiting. It's already been almost two hours already. So, I think we deserve a refund, and for everything that's been happening, it's just unbelievable. One more look at the moon, and I will let you go for now, and I'll save some more for later. Uh-oh, it's not focusing. Come on, focus. Focus, focus. There we go. So if anybody says, oh, your camera, blah, 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 I'm tired of it. I'm too bad. All the trolls out there, too bad. Seek Jesus. That's all there is to it. There's something wrong with our sun. There's something wrong with the moon. The moon looks like the sun right now. What's going on with that? It looks orange and yellow. That's crazy. And I can almost see some details that I usually can never get. But thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. God bless.